Hello all, how are you doing today? I am here to review a candle for you. Um, I'm actually using a new camera um, that I got for my boyfriend for Christmas, so I don't know if the lighting is gonna be okay. Um, this is gonna be kind of experimental. Let me know if everything is nice and clear, if you can see everything wonderfully, because, you know, I, it's hard to tell, you know, when it's new, it might take some adjusting, but uh, comment down below and let me know, because I want to know if everything's working okay. Okay, so the candle I have to review for you today is Holiday. Um, Holiday is from the Holiday Traditions collection from Bath and Body Works. Um, it's, uh, yeah, it was interesting. So <laughs> let's go ahead and talk about the candle and everything about it. So Holiday looks like this. Here is the packaging. And again, it's going to take me a while to get used to how to show you. Here's Holiday. It says Bath and Body Works Holiday Scented Candle. And it's got this adorable little snowman and this little bunny who's putting lights on him. There's a little bird up there in the corner who's helping. Um, and then over here to the sides, you can see there's like these teal kind of metallic film trees with little lights on them. Um, it's cute. I think it's very, very cute. I think it's a very adorable candle. I actually like this packaging a little bit better than like the Holly Jolly Christmas one. Um, I just think this is super cute with a little snowman seam. Um, it has the snowflake lid, as you can see there. And the wax is just a bright red color, um, just, you know, primary color red. Um, you know, pretty basic. So, um, packaging I think is absolutely adorable on this one. Um, I'll give it like you know, an 8 out of 10. I think all of the holiday traditions packaging is pretty cute. Um, I know it's kind of cutesy, but I think it's whimsical. I think it's, you know, it, it's got whimsy, and that's really, you know, what Christmas is about. You know, the whimsy and the innocence of childhood and all of that. So, um, I actually really like the packaging. I know a lot of people said it's very childlike, but I love it. So, um, I'll give it an 8 out of 10 on packaging. I really enjoyed the whole holiday traditions kind of line this year. It says on the bottom, the scent description says, The warmth and spices of the holidays are captured in a special blend of cinnamon and clove, highlighted by fresh burger. Um, I think that is just totally not true at all. This is just like a cinnamon candle. <laughs> like, you smell nothing in this candle but cinnamon, which is a great thing if you love cinnamon. Um, it just kind of depends on if you are into that or not. I don't smell any clove. I don't smell any bergamot. I smell none of that. Um, None of it on cold sniff or while it's burning. I mean, I smell just straight up cinnamon oil, cinnamon candle, just period. It really just smells like you are burning a very, very strong cinnamon oil in like an oil burner. Um, it smells like a bag of Red Hots or if you eat the little gummy cinnamon bears. Um, like a cinnamon candy is what it smells like. It just smells like a straight up cinnamon candy. Um, but I actually really like cinnamon, so I'm okay with that. I actually really enjoyed the scent, but if you are not a cinnamon, spicy, hot, red hot candle type person, you're gonna hate this. Um, it is very strong, very spicy, and it's just like a very, very in your face cinnamon, um, which I thought was perfect for Christmas time. So I actually burned this, you know, this last week as we were going through Christmas and the holidays, and um, I thought it was really great. I think it made the house smell like Christmas should smell. So I really enjoyed the scent. Um, so I would give it an eight out of 10 on the scent appeal. Um, just because I really like cinnamon scents, but if you don't like cinnamon, you're gonna absolutely hate this. It's gonna make you sick. Um, my mom didn't like this because she doesn't like cinnamon candles, so she was like, there's no way I'm buying that. I'm totally passing. I don't want it at all. Um, but I love cinnamon, so I really like this. Um, the throw on this candle, when it was actually performing, which I'll talk about that in a second, um, when it was actually burning well like it's supposed to, um, this was incredibly, incredibly strong. I would say it's like a 9 out of 10. It was one of the strongest candles that I've burned, you know, recently or in the past couple of, uh, you know, collections. But the problem was it didn't burn good at all. Um, this was one of the worst candles 
I have ever burned. Um, and again, not all of them are going to be that way. It could just be mine. Um, you know, you can't really generalize what I'm saying because it depends on the wicks and, you know, it depends on what batch you got. You really cannot take what a reviewer is going to tell you to heart as far as the performance unless they burn multiple 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 you know numbers of the candle um this is the only one i bought the only one i've burned but it was so bad um i didn't give up on it i made it all the way to the end as you can see um i don't give up on the candle it's you know we're gonna make it to the end so i can throw you in the trash with happiness <laughs> but um Oh my gosh, so when I first started burning it, um, you know, and it was barely even down the candle, it had like little, little tiny baby flames that you could barely even see, and so it was like barely, barely staying lit, barely burning, and so it wasn't putting out any scent. Um, so I I got my little spoon and I, I poured out a ton of the wax, like I swear I poured out like half an inch to an inch of wax, so it was like half my candle was already gone when I had just lit it, which is kind of a ripoff, you know. Um, so then once I emptied a lot of the wax, it started to have, you know, nice high flames. It started like burning like it, like it should. Um, and when it started burning like it should, this baby was strong. So, you know, I burned it for like two hours. Then I had to empty some wax. Then it started burning great and it burned great for the rest of that evening. The next day I lit it. Burned for another, you know, hour or so until the wax started pooling. Again, I ended up with a tiny, tiny baby flames. I had to pour out a ton of wax. Like, normally, if, if, if wicks are drowning, I can just pour out, like, you know two or three spoonfuls or you know if you do the cotton ball trick and that's not a whole lot of wax you know it's enough to just kind of raise the wicks up a little bit and everything's fine i had to empty like everything that had pulled just to get this to burn it was absolutely terrible um so i had to empty wax out of this two times i probably literally poured half of the candle in the trash because i had to you know get rid of so much wax which i hate you know because you're getting ripped off you're not getting as many hours of burn as you could and it's just annoying but um one while the candle was burning the way it should it was awesome i mean the throw was amazing it smelled wonderfully and i enjoyed it but then i was like oh here we go again Oh, here we go again. Um, so it was a huge pain in the butt. Um, this one, this was probably one of the worst ever. Um, this is one of the worst since the autumn sky one that I burned in the fall. It was absolutely terrible. Um, so let me know if you guys are having the same issues as far as the performance on this one or if yours, you know, did well. Comment below because again, I don't want somebody to watch the video and not get the candle when it's performing well for everybody else. So if you got it and it burned great for you, let me know down below so that you guys can read it and say, oh, well, you know, just hers was bad, but everybody else's was good. So I'll go ahead and buy the candle. Um, so yeah, one was more than enough of holiday. Um, I loved the scent. If this one would actually perform well, I would love this. I would buy multiples, you know, if they were on sale. But because it was so terrible, I was just so frustrated with it by the end that I'm like, I don't even want to look at holiday anymore. I'm just, I'm through. Like, I'm through with it. I'm done. Um, but yeah, so it smells amazing. It throws like a champion. If if you can get it to burn. At least that was my experience. So that is my review of the Candle Holiday from the Holiday Traditions line from Bath and Body Works. Um, great cinnamon candle. If you're into cinnamon, give it a try. Yours might work a lot better than mine. So let me know um, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!